Jama Masjid. Jama Masjid, yeah. Old Delhi. Yeah, Old Delhi, yeah. I, I drop you tuk-tuk. And how much? 350. 350? Old Delhi far. Uh, okay, yeah, 80, 80. 80 rupees? Yeah. Joking. Oh, no, it will be possible. Possible. Okay. Possible. Uh -huh. On the way, stop the bazaar. 10 meter look. No, I just want to go to Jama Masjid, 80. Okay. No, 80 rupees, okay. Okay, good. But stop the bazaar, uh -huh. looking 10, 15 minutes. Then no, after no thank you. I just want to go to my destination, Jama Masjid. Destination, then 350? 350? All the way far. Why would I pay like four times the price for something? Yeah. Let's get one from the main street. Hello. <laughs> How much you pay? 80, 80. I told you 80. I don't. I'm not trying to bargain. No, I'm going to get one from the main street. This place is ridiculous. Two million views. Oh wow, so apparently that guy that just tried to overcharge me for a wreck show, Broke Forever saying was in Cal Rogue's video. Yeah. Labeled as a scam or not, is a scam. And he got 2.8 million views. To Find where he is. Let's see where he is. Hello, oh. we got the Jama Masjid. 80. 120. Huh? 120? No, 80, 80. Jane wale bhai. Huh? One more guy. Where is it? Same one. Yeah, 80, okay? No, but no, no. Not we'll get one from 80 from the street. There he is. Oh yeah, Batman. it's the same guy. <laughs> <laughs> Try to scam. Oh. Well. <laughs> it's 41 rupees yeah. where he was paying. I think they were asking over 150. Yeah. <laughs> uh, 100, okay? 120. No, no, no. We'll get one from 100 from the street. No, no, no. No, 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 no. No. It's your loss. You don't want to make money. Go ahead. Huh? 100, okay? Okay, thank you, my friend. Okay. That's how you get it. Oh, 6.5 kilometers. So if they go by the meter, it should be like 75. Mm -hmm. Would you like an extra large condom? <laughs> oh, thank you. No, thank you. It's too small for me. Main one, huh? Yes, can you ask Corona back where you're from? Hello, Sin. Hello. No, don't touch me. Don't touch me. Go away. No. Go. Don't touch me. Go away. <laughs> Hairy arm. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Come from the other direction. Go away. No, we don't want you here. Go away. He thinks it's hilarious. <laughs> but it's, what's that? God damn well, it, what the what did the, uh, I don't want to assume the pronoun, but what did they say? They said, uh, sh shut up, or something like Coming that. Coming from the other side, I think. Oh, good. Right, now we really need to get a hand sanitizer. What, just asking for money for what? For nothing? Yeah, yeah, just for nothing. Because I'm to, a, to, to not get hassled? Yeah, yeah. Give me money or I'll hassle you, I'll touch you. Dude, I used to do, uh, like, uh, I've done wedding photography and yeah. stuff, so I, I was at, the, at this client's place recently to get my uh, money. And uh, when I got there, he was like, oh, could you wait for like 10-15 uh, minutes? I'm like, uh, why? It's like there are some people over, you know, these guys, they have their own gangs. They, they, uh, so any, anytime you get married in India, yeah. they'll, they'll come to your place and they'll start asking for money. And, and if, you don't, if, you was, if you don't, if you don't watch the consequences. They start stripping and, you know, oh. and dancing and, you know, that. Oh, that. just ruining your day, yeah, actually. Yeah. And, then, and then it's a big thing in India, like, people yeah. have their reputation and stuff, so... Yeah, they just want rid of yeah, them, yeah, so right. they'll pay them to go away. Right. So that's what that person was trying to do. Yeah. yeah. Oh, bloody hell. So they were asking for 150,000 rupees from them. What? Just because they got married. That's mental. They're like, yeah, but there's, uh, there's, like, we, we, there's like 20 of us, we have to take care of our people, so yeah. you guys need to pay. They're yeah. like, we're not going to pay. They gave him 20,000 rupees. Bloody which hell. Is, which is still a lot, according yeah. to me. Uh, but they were, yeah, they were asking for 150,000. One of them even started stripping and taking their clothes oh, off. It's disgusting. And they were like, yeah, it was pretty insane. That's what they do. That's their ultimate weapon, is like stripping. <laughs> yeah, you got to take a look at this now. That's their... Uh, yeah. Traffic, I think by the time they get to wherever they're going, the fire's gonna be out oh, yeah. by itself. Yeah. So it was just well, I give a fire, I give him a tip. I give you a tip because of traffic, okay? 120, okay. So here we are. Back in this crazy place. And we came to eat, didn't we? <laughs> We're brave. We're feeling brave. So let's go for some desi grub. I think we should buy some uh, sanitizer. Hand sanitizer? Yeah, yeah first. Uh, 
Okay, first we're going to buy a hand sanitizer because we've been out and about all day and haven't washed our hands anywhere. Haven't you had any beer? Jeez. <laughs> okay, hand sanitizer. Down this big street. Oh, there's a. Really? Okay. Maybe you might have. No hand sanitizer, okay. Okay. So, but some of these places will have hand washed basins and stuff, right? With they like would, but soap and Where's the water coming from here? What do you think? Oh, yeah. Look at the. So, you see this? All these people lined up. These guys are all getting free food and they're fighting over it. Some guy's trying to push in to the line right here. Uh, what happens is some of these restaurants give out free meals to people who need them. I think people donate, maybe the restaurant manager, he contributes a bit. But uh, they all know about this time to come to a few certain restaurants around here and uh, they can get fed. Sorry, sir, sorry. Uh, Oh, this guy again. I had before, I had before, it's a good one. I know, I had before, yeah, he remembers, he remembers me. I ate it, it was good. It was very nice. Again, again. Okay, I haven't washed my hands, okay. Very nice. It was very nice, very nice, thank you. Thank you. Thanks, thank you. Have you seen a previous video? I got some of that guy's almond bread, it's fantastic. These are amazing. Yeah. So, gonna see if we get some hand sanitizer before we start eating stuff around here. The last place didn't have any. Sanitizer, yeah. I'm out of cash. Too. All right, no worries again. How much? Yeah, it's been used. This, this is here. Is there a, this new or no? Look. Yeah, it's new. Maybe that comes. Yeah. Yeah, they all the same. Okay. There we go. Nice and clean. Let's go. They haven't done. Okay. Hi. <laughs> well, now. We have two clean hands, we can eat all the food around here. Fantastic. I did eat that bread that the guy put in my hand before I cleaned my hand, but it's just it's just my instinct is when somebody puts food in my hand to stick it in my gob. So uh, yeah, hopefully I don't get sick. And uh, yeah, let's find something nice around here. Okay, well, we're trying to get through this massive traffic jam of people and vehicles. Uh, <laughs> it looks like they were kind of like heading down towards a uh, fabrics and textiles kind of area. There's no more food stalls. I don't know if we should keep trying down here, but we're going to follow it anyway. Yeah. Might uh, discover a new street food market. Yeah, one, one, one that Mark Wiens hasn't been to. Yeah. There's a guy who looks like he's selling kebabs or something, shawarma maybe. You up for a wee shawarma? And here, oh fuck, look how cheap it is, 30 or 40 for a paratha, paratha roll or parantha roll? What's the difference between paratha and parantha? Just the spelling. The spelling, ah, oh, okay. The same thing. What do you reckon? You up for a shawarma then or something? Yeah, or? try a shawarma. Okay, two shawarmas please. Okay. That's the chicken, yeah, chicken. Okay, good. You sit inside, yes? Okay. Hey man, how are you? Good? Okay, good. Does this water look clean to you or get the water somewhere else? Okay, sanitizer back out. You want some? Thank you. Oh, looks like it does rolls as well. Little rolls. Um, you call him Pav, you call him Pav, right? Pav. Right. Oh, is that the shawarma there? Is he toasting them like in a toasting machine? This is shawarma here. Oh, so after he puts the meat in, he gives it like a little grilling with that, like a cheese toasty. That's nice. Very good. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> oh, selfie time. Come on. 
Ah, yeah. oh, good. He doesn't want you. Okay. Oh, this is my shawarma. Oh, thank you very much. There you go. Good. Okay. Oh, it does look good, doesn't it? Oh. I wonder what this is. It looks like some kind of spicy mayonnaise or something that's in there. And the shawarma looks like it's, well, it's orange, so it looks like it's uh, yeah. like a tikka. Chicken tikka? Yeah, something like that. Okay, well, like that. I guess I'll find out when I put it in my mouth. And this is Broke's one. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. We got uh, unlimited mayo. I'll just take what's on it, I think. Yeah. Just this stuff. It looks like it's uh, all sauced up. Good. Uh, it's pretty hot. This okay. is good. Yeah. To okay. Thank you. He can see that we're going to get messy, so give her some extra plates. No, that's for uh, the. That's, that's for the sauce. Yeah. What is it? This is this, this is mayo. Oh, it's just mayo, yeah. Yeah, and that's ketchup. Okay. Oh, that's good. Looks like lotion. Okay. Well, let's. Uh, oh, this is roasting hot, but that's what you want. It means. Yeah. You uh, want it oily hot. Yeah. You want it hot. Believe me. Mmm! Very nice. It is bloody nice, it's really nice. It's chicken tikka, tikka chicken. Chicken, chicken. Nah. Nah, it's lovely. It's really uh, covered in uh, covered in the tikka spices and it's delicious. One selfie. Oh, he wants a selfie? Yeah, one selfie. If it's a selfie, he has to take it himself. Otherwise, it's not a selfie. <laughs> Okay, good. Okay. Well, this is a selfie, but this is a selfie. This is a selfie. Oh, it's good. Oh, nice one. A good one. Yeah, it's a good one. Good. Okay. Let's further enjoy this man's food. This is fantastic. Especially for uh, 30 rupees is a bargain. Oh, yeah. Chicken's good. Ah, uh, okay, thank you. Wipe my hands. Give us this. In lieu of a tissue. Good. Very nice, very nice. Very tasty, very tasty. This is a family business. You all family, yes? Ah, oh, very nice. I like a good family business. Okay. I give to the son? Okay, keep the change, my friend. Keep the change. Tip for you. Thank you. Okay. Fantastic. Oh, well worth 30 rupees. A bargain. And, uh, aye, not too big a meal so I can further explore the streets of Old Delhi for more grub. Well, Rogue's just noticed right behind us, right there. This guy seems to be doing some kind of like banana shakes right outside. That's where he came out. Oh, I've got that spiciness in my throat, so I need something refreshing and cold. There's a bit of a puddle going on here, though. Hello. Is this a banana milkshake or banana shake or what is it? Uh, you use ice or no ice? Ice. We need with no ice. You no, you do it without the ice, or you can do it without ice. Okay, good. Uh, banana milkshake without ice. Okay, good. Yes, two, two, please, two. Hi, how are you? How much is it? Maybe he wants more because there's no ice. If it's like more, it needs more bananas in it or something. How much is it, sir? How much? 20 each, so 40. Okay, 20 for one. Another bargain. Yeah, uh, good. Huh? Indian currency, Indian currency, yes. Good Indian currency. <laughs> Chanso. <laughs> you from here? You from Delhi? Yes. Uh, okay. And it's a good stall. You come here a lot, this one. I come here regular. Regular? Ah, oh, okay. So it's a good. Okay, we've got bananas, sugar, and was it milk? Yes. Ah, okay. Without ice. Banana shake, huh? Everyone around here, they're drinking this banana shake. <laughs> you, you from Scotland? Yes, how you know from my voice? You're just guessing. <laughs> yes, I'm from Scotland, yes. Nice place. Yeah, very, very nice place. My name is Dale, what is your name? Abu Wakar. Say again? Abu Wakar. Abu Wakar. 
<laughs> I'm also a footballer. Second? I'm also a footballer. You're a footballer? Really? For India or for a club? In the club, Venus club. Ah, okay, good. I played very early in Ah, okay, good. What position you play? Midfielder. Midfielder, okay, good. My favorite position. Ah, oh, good. Yes. You also play? No, I play, but I'm not good. Well, yeah. You have to train? No, I'm like, I eat a lot of food and stuff, you know. <laughs> I'm too big. Look, if I run around, I'm very slow. You're like a nice and slim. Yeah, maybe I'm better for wrestling or something, not soccer. I, 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 You're not good at wrestling? No. <laughs> I'm regular customer for here. Regular customer for here, good. I like it. This gives this give me energy to do more. Oh, good. I like it. If a place has regular customers, it means that the place is good. So we like to see that. If we see a place where there's only tourists who are going, it's probably bad. But if we see the local people with the Indians... Okay, hang on, I'll pay the man first. Okay. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Okay, so 20 rupees a piece. Banana shake. Banana, sugar and milk. Do you want to give it the first sip? Do you want to give it the taste test, Mr. Broke? Tastes like banana shake. Yeah, <laughs> good. That's what you want it to taste like. And it is cold as well, without the ice, the, the, the milk itself makes it nice and cold, so... Ah, very nice. You're right, this is very good. Very refreshing. This guy's amazed. He's never seen someone tank a whole, a whole pint of banana milkshake in one go. Oh, so good. Thank you, my friend. Thank you very much. Oh, uh, more? Okay. I'll try another place. I'll try another place for more variety. Okay. See you, my friend. See you. Thank you. Okay. Oh, that was good. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we're going nice back up the. Uh, we're going back up the the top of the street then. Yeah. What else? What type of food should we go for? Do you reckon? Uh, let's try some of the. Uh, some of the Banana shakes are popular around right here. Seeing them everywhere. Yeah, I didn't even see any on the way yeah. down. Now I'm seeing them all. Yeah, I didn't see it. You want to try a kebab? He's like, yeah. How are you? Hello guys, YouTube, yes, YouTube. Hello. Hello. He's not happy. The kids, the kids, the kids. It was the kids that stopped me. Yeah. Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> I don't know if they're attacking me or if they're playing with me. I think they're playing. They're friendly kids. Here's the good food around here. What is good? We need kebab, kebab, kebab. Around here. We just come from that way. Up there, kebab. Anywhere? <laughs> no, they don't know the word kebab. Is there another word in the Hindi for kebab or something? Or? That's it. Okay. Kebab, kebab. Which way? Okay, they don't know. I don't think they. I don't, they don't think they. Yeah, they don't eat kebabs. They don't know what they eat. But, uh, what? Maybe they're vegan kids. We've been that way. We've been that way. Okay. This guy's just shoving me out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they do on the street. Basically, just like if you're in someone's way, you just get shoved. Yeah. Okay. Hello. Another traffic jam. We're in the middle of it again. Better to be on this side because we can be uh, see what traffic's coming. Hang on, man. Hang on. Hang on, bro. This bakery looks really popular. Which means it's probably good. Right, look at all these people. Oh, yeah. That means it's probably good. They might get something from here to take away. Check it out. But ask people what the popular thing is here. I think this is a queue. What is good here? Which one is good here? You know which one is good? This man, he is good. Okay. <laughs> I'm trying to find out. I don't know if there's a queue or what. I don't know what's going on. There's a queue, there's a queue. I don't know if he works here or he's a customer or what. Hi. What is good here? Do you know which one is good? All of them. Okay, I'll try something, I guess. Uh, I know what he's getting. Depends on what you want to get, a cookie or... Pretty sure this is a queue. That looks like some kind of like sesame toast or something like that. 
don't know what it is. It's like a hard toast. A hard toast, yeah. Oh. So you got cookies and stuff. Aye, which is good here? Which one is good? Ah, this cake. It's a cake? Ah, it looked like toast to me. A cake with what? What ingredients? 240 rupees a kilo. You said 240 rupees a kilo. But what is in the cake? One piece. One piece? I don't know. I'm trying to find out about it. Uh, and this stuff looks like some kind of cookies. This looks probably more up my street. This one. What's happening? I have no idea. <laughs> looks like they're making it high. My country is Scotland. Okay, what is good here? Do you know what is good here? Oh, yeah. Indian, Indian. This is bakery. This is Indian bakery. Bakery, best bakery. What one is the most good? All is good. Coconut. Oh, this one is coconut in the middle. Coconut. This one here on the left. This is coconut. Ah, uh, coconut biscuits. Ah, okay. This is the best bakery in all of where? All of Delhi? All of India? All of India. All of India. Ah, oh, good. And what did you buy? What did you buy? I. This you got from the bakery or no? Or you now you're coming to buy? Now you're coming to buy? Ah, okay, good. I'm going to get some of these coconut biscuits, I think. It will be good. My name is Dale. What is your name? My name is Muhammad Amin Hayat. Muhammad, pleased to meet you. Salam alaikum. Okay. Okay, I don't understand what you're saying, but. Good. Yes, good. Thank you for the advice. I'll take your advice and get those coconut biscuits. Thank you, my friend. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Sorry to get in everyone's way. Okay. Uh, well, I was in the queue before them, so hopefully they don't mind me jumping back in. I won't be too rude if I do that. Okay. It says no plastic bags, but they've got That's like good. a ton of plastic bags right here. All right, yeah. So, Greta approved. Greta doesn't approve. Mm -hmm. I got both. How are you? This good place? What do you think of these ones? The coconut biscuits? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm going to get. I want these coconut biscuits. You said at 240 for per kilo. 200. Uh, can you give me uh, 300 grams, please? 300 grams. So that should be 60. 60 rupees. Okay. This? Yes. Yes, this one. Coconut, right? If that man was correct. So he says it's 200 rupees per kilo for this one. So I asked for 300. So that's 60 rupees. It's a pretty decent portion. No, it's a lot. <laughs> I didn't actually know how much, how many biscuits 300 grams would end up being. Really? Oh yeah. Oh wow. Should I ask for like 100 or 200? Okay. You said no plastic bags. <laughs> okay. Just for jokes. Okay. Okay. Fantastic. Fantastic. I got a big bag of cookies. Hi. I'm from Scotland. Scotland. Where are you from? India. India, India. good. And Delhi, Delhi, Delhi. Delhi, oh. And this is the best bakery around here. Because look how busy it is. Yeah? Okay, good. I'm going to go enjoy these coconut biscuits. Huh? Your good name? My YouTube name? Yeah. Or my good name? Did you say ask for my, my good name? I thought you asked for my YouTube name. <laughs> Dale, Dale. Dale. And you? Ifran. If, Ifran Ali. Yeah. Oh, okay, assalamu alaikum, sir. <laughs> oh, good. Okay, see you. Have a nice day, my friend. Okay, hang on. Good. See you, my friend. See you. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Well, I'm probably actually going to take these home and join them later, but I might pull one out for you guys and uh, give it the taste test. Oh. Yeah, let's see what's so good about the best meat. This man's making a door. The transport in door. Okay, hand sanitizer. And then we'll give it a wee taste test. Oh. Oh, you dropped it. This is difficult. Wiping my hands and then touching my bag, touching everything. <laughs> I'm just trying to uh, avoid the stomach bug, that's all it is. Uh, why don't I just put my hand in my pocket and touch my money? <laughs> I'm gonna have to sanitize my hands again. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, again. There you go. No, don't touch anything. Okay. Oh, just that's straight into sanitized. the. Straight I'm gonna into get the... But this a wee go. Let's see. Oh, plastic and inside as well. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. Double plastic. Coconut biscuits. Oh! What do you think? Oh, it's good. Yeah, it's good. 
you think? Are you good? Come on, come on. I'm gonna try half of it. Oh, wow. Very nice, very nice. I'm not even gonna be hard. You're very soft. Very soft. It's almost melted okay. in the mouth. Wow, I'm gonna have Oh, even more. Yeah. Pretty. <laughs> Pretty forever. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, you know it? Yeah. Okay. Why have you got me asking people where it is then? Where, where I can get a kebab if you know where a good one is? Wow. Okay, let's get out of this craziness and find it then. Oh, wow. Got your family on that bike. What is it? Qureshi kebab. Crazy kebabs. <laughs> Not crazy, Qureshi. Qureshi. Right there, on the board. All right, Qureshi kebabs, according to Mr. Broke Forever, is the best kebab in Delhi, and the place does look busy. So that's always a good sign. It's busy with locals, that is. Brilliant. Yeah. So what's the choices? It's all just chicken, or there's... There's chicken a... and uh, mutton, lamb, whatever. Ah. I'll take it, I'll fry it, I'll kebab. There it is. Okay. Right, uh, I'll get one first and eat it, and then uh, yeah. I'll get one for you, okay? Okay. Okay, what's the difference between one kebab, one kebab roll? You just put it in like a bread roll or yeah, something like that? Yeah, put it in like a little... Okay, I'll just get a modern group. kebab then. Since we're eating chicken yeah. already, now it's yeah, time yeah. for modern. Yeah. Uh, one modern kebab, please. One takeaway here. I want to eat here, right, right where I'm standing. Oh. <laughs> Look like they got anywhere to sit down or whatever. Just stand around the streets. Yeah. But my friend, he says this is the best kebab in Delhi. The Kureshi kebab corner. Yes, Kureshi kebab corner. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it does say corner. Yeah. Okay. That's where they're grilling them up on flames. Just seeing they've got some signs up here. They won some kind of street food award in Delhi in 2018. Uh, oh, sponsored by Detto, so I guess that means it's clean. Well, the noise, the noise level around here is crazy. <laughs> Where are you from? Scotland. Scotland. Where are you from? Yeah, he is owner. Oh, you're the owner yeah, for yeah, this is Mr. Qureshi. Oh, Qureshi. You're Qureshi, and this is your kebabs. His name is Arshad Qureshi. Ah, this place is famous, right? Yeah, okay. Famous. Okay, this is my one right here. I'm gonna try this famous kebab. Oh, I was expecting it to be in a. Um, you eat this. After, tell him how this is. Tell him how it is. That's okay. very good. Ah, okay. I thought it was going to become in the, like uh, some bread or something like that. No, that's oh, a roll. Just like this. Yeah, roti. Roti. Ah, okay. Ah, okay. Well, I'll give this a go. Just the meat. Oh, nice and tender. I can tell just already. Test, just test. Roti. Nice and tender. Oh. This is good. Back off. Standing with the owner. <laughs> yeah. Just standing here chilling yeah, with, with the owner. owner. Okay. Uh, eat his kebab, basically. Let's <laughs> give it a go. Yeah. It feels nice and tender anyway. Oh, wow. Yeah. 
That's the softest meat I've ever tasted. Yeah. Wow. How did they get it so soft? That's the secret. How do you get the, the meat so soft? Juicy. Yeah, soft and juicy. But if I try to make kebab, it's not going to be good like this. So what is the secret? Indian spice. Indian spice? Ah, oh, okay. And how are they cooking it? Is this like a minced, minced mutton, right? Yeah, mutton, and chicken, corn. buffalo, uh, and fish. You yeah, have fish and buffalo as well. I didn't see it on the menu. See? Where's buffalo? Chicken, and yes. fish. But no buffalo. I thought you said buffalo. <laughs> oh, this is nice. Yeah. And what is the sauce? This, taste, this feels like it's butter and something yeah, else. Yeah, some uh, butter and sauce, chili sauce and onion. Butter and chili sauce and a little bit of onion inside. I haven't tried it with the onion. I'll add that, just an extra little bit. An extra little bit of kick to it. This is really nice, it really is nice, wow. <laughs> wow. Some chicken? Uh, next my friend will try one. Yeah. I think so, there's a chicken one for you. you no, I don't mother? want the chicken one. As well. I want the mutton. What's the mutton? Yeah. 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 Oh, wow. Mm, finish it already. I think we're going to have to order another one for me as well. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. Incredible. Yeah. That was so tasty. Wow. Chicken one? Oh, for me? Yeah. Okay. It's got a chicken one as well. Oh, it's very hot. It should come straight off the grill, I think. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm just gonna give this a go. If I can pick it up, it's really hot. But that's what you want. You know, when you're in this kind of like environment, you want to make sure it's clean. It's gotta be uh, straight off the oven, burning hot. Wow, wow, wow. This is incredible. Oh, <laughs> All dripped in the buttery sauce. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. yeah. Very nice. Do you know how many every day how many kebabs do you sell? Maybe more than 1,000. Million. Right? <laughs> easily 1,000. This is like easily yeah. 1,000. 5,000? 1,000. Uh, you, you, you lose count. You lose count. Yeah. <laughs> okay. It's all dripped in the butter. Look at this. And then. So good. Oh. How's it compared to the other one? To compare to what yeah. we had in the street? No, no, compared to the mutton, this one. How does this compare to the mutton? Yeah. Oh, they're both good, but they just have different tastes. Yeah. Yeah, they're both the same. Uh, the meat is just so soft and juicy on both of them. Yeah. It's like, you don't barely have to chew it. You barely have to chew it. And then, all covered in this buttery sauce. The butter makes everything taste good, oh, yeah. doesn't it? But even I tried the meat first without the butter. Okay. Yeah. Incredible. Yeah, good. <laughs> Very nice. Still waiting for mine. Gotta get the mutton. Okay. Oh, swap, 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 swap. Okay. Okay, thank you, thank you. Okay, now broke forever. He's gonna get. Oh! What are you saying? Amazing. You've had this before though, right? Oh, yeah. So you know how good it tastes. Still be way better. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You can see how they make them over here. Yeah.
What is it? Tea. Oh, some chai. Yeah. Oh, okay, yes. Okay, get us some chai. The friendly owner standing right here. How many staff does he have? It's like one guy serving and how many people cooking? I think that, sorry, sorry, oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> it's a busy area. Yeah, how, how many, oh, you have seating inside? I didn't realize that. He has seating, he has seating. It wasn't very obvious at all. What's up? Oh, no, sorry. Okay, looks like we're gonna get a seat. I didn't realize that. Hey, people trying to steal it from me. How many times have you been here? You didn't realize they had seats? I've just been here once. Oh, have you? Oh. Oh, it's down the alley. <laughs> no wonder we didn't know. It's definitely not obvious. Oh, oh okay. Ah, oh, okay. So this is... Ah, oh, wow. So, yeah, you have, he has like a separate building around here. Ah, so he has the main one on the street. And then, oh, it's nice and quiet in here. I'm coming in uh, <laughs> with my big, loud Scottish voice. But he has uh, this also. Nice. Good. Everyone's looking at me now. Okay. <laughs> People like who's this? Oh, he has, he has a place for washing your hands as well, isn't it? Oh, wow. So this is where you should come if you want some to relax and not. Yeah. If you want the craziness, yeah, stand, stand on the street. <laughs> okay, I'll get my hands a wash. Check it out. Steaming hot. Oh yeah. Oh, good. Well, they actually have a, a, a sign right here saying, keep silent, please, because apparently this is the family area. I think that's what you said when I came in. I think you said this is the family area. So, a nice wee quiet place to come enjoy your kebab. Let's <laughs> me to come outside. Ah. Where's he taking me? My bag's there. He's taking me somewhere, I don't know. He's taking me somewhere else. So there's somewhere else. Oh, you have another building. Oh, this is for men. Sorry, uh, uh, it's very quiet in here. <laughs> Everyone's supposed to be quiet in here, right? Yes. Oh, this is nice. So you have two, building, two buildings here and then the one on the main street as well. But does everyone know about this? Because my friend, me and my friend, we didn't know about these shops. We only knew about the one on the street. The street only. Yeah, we only knew about this. There's no sign or anything that says we can come here, but they order there yeah. and they, they, the, the, the men, they bring the, the, the kebabs to here from the... Yes, yes, yes. The, ah, okay, I understand. That's good. It's a very famous place in, in Delhi now, yes. Is that it? Yeah. Yeah. Is this for the whole of India or for Delhi? Yes, Delhi. yes. Yeah. American centers. Yeah. Oh, wow. And nice, has air conditioning and everything. Nice and comfortable. Yes. <laughs> oh, that's nice, I'm glad I found this little space. Hello. Okay, hello, how are you? Enjoy your kebab. Have a, have a nice kebab. <laughs> I had two nice kebabs. Okay, let's see how Mr. Brock is getting on. I think he finished his. Are you done? Are you done, Mr. Brock? Okay. Well, uh, apparently there's another building next door. I think this is the family room. And next door is one that's just for men. Oh. Yeah, so. That's nice. Okay. Can we uh, pay here or at the at the main street? We'll do it at the main street. Okay. Oh, you got us some tea. <laughs> oh, no, I don't want, I, I, you don't want? Oh, it's really hot. We should sit down. We want to go to the men's yeah, area. Uh, okay. 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 Oh. 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 It's burning hot chai, right? That's your job. Ah, it's not too hot. Yes, this is, a, this is actually really fancy. So you might want to, if you come here, order the kebab on the street and then bring it to here. Or just order it here if you can. So it depends if you want the craziness of the streets, you want the experience, or you just want to chill, relax. Air conditioning in the background. Well, you, uh, I don't know if they sell the chai as well, but I think they, got, yeah, I think the manager's just been very accommodating to us because we got cameras or well, I've got a camera and he's, he, he brought us both a, a cup of tea, which is nice to wash down the kebab with. Ah, proper Indian chai, full of milk and sugar, love it. <laughs> mm. so this is just a menu, no one. Yeah. 
It's kind of because it's an Islamic area, I guess. They do, they do that. <coughs> I need a cold drink. <coughs> Everyone's thinking I got corona or something. Because <laughs> it's just as hot. Okay. I guess uh, I didn't pay for that, did I? So I'm going to pay at the main street, I think. Yeah. I'll go back to the main street and pay. Uh, thank you. Good. <laughs> you just see me pat my belly. Fantastic. Oh. oh, that's very good. We're very happy now. Uh, I pay the cashier man here, right? No, no. You don't accept? Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> He's giving us complimentary kebabs, so it tastes even better. Wow. That's fantastic. Sorry, sorry. Thanks very much, my friend. Thank you, okay. Mr. Qureshi. See you. Okay. That's very nice. Right, thank you. Okay, sorry. I don't I know if you wanted to shake hands or not. <laughs> Just now everybody's been a bit wary about shaking each other's hands and stuff. Anyway, yeah. Uh, at least, I think that's the first time I got something for free for being a vlogger. <laughs> I've had the offers before, loads of times for free hotels and stuff like that. It's just never been worth it for me to, I don't know, promote somebody's hotel or something for the sake of a $70 room or anything. But, uh, yeah, you got my honest opinion of those kebabs. I didn't realize I was getting them for free. So, yeah, 10 out of 10. So often they'll give something a 10 out of 10. <laughs> Well, this thing says something refreshment center and some weird looking liquid. Don't know what that is, but uh, I'm going to find out right now if I can crow. He wasn't slowing down, was he? <laughs> well, it looks like it's all lassies and stuff like that. Flavored milk. Well, I'm up for that. I'm up for that. Some fresh flavored milk. Hi. What flavors do you have? Oh, it's all here. Uh, how about rose milk? It's going to be like Faluda, right? Yeah. That'd be nice. Uh, one rose milk and. You don't know rose milk? Only uh, kesar badam. Say again? Only milk kesar badam. Milk kesar. Milk kesar badam. He's only got this one. Milk kesar badam. Do you know what that is? Um, kesar badam. It's uh, saffron, I think. Saffron and something, right? Yeah. Looks like saffron and some kind of nuts or something. Yeah. Okay. Uh, two of these, please. Two. Yes. Right. What do you reckon? Thank you, sir. Thank you. Uh, it tastes like uh, melted coffee. Tastes like what? Melted coffee. Melted coffee. <laughs> mm. Well, I like coffee, so give it a go. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's nice. It's uh, it's, it's full of nuts. It's full of, like almonds or something. Yeah, it's almonds, yeah. Kill the little bits there. Oh, yeah. ah, nice, just what I needed. Very good. Okay, apparently we've got to leave the bottles here. And uh, yeah, we're going to further explore these streets. I'm not full yet. So, yeah. What's happening? Why have they got this big pile of books? For what? He's selling books. He's oh, he's books. just selling it on the street. So he's just dumped them there and no shop, no no table, nothing. So how does he run away when the cops come and tell him to I shift off the streets? Yeah, the cops don't come here. Ah, okay. Not yeah. Oh, I have spotted a fruit shop right here. A fruit juice shop. I see the fruit and I see the shaker machine. The blender. Oh, and he has the pomegranates. What are you, what'd you say to another pomegranate juice? Yeah, uh, I'm not only gonna have a small one, because I'm kind of full from all that tea and... Oh, well, he does them in full glasses. Yeah. Hi, uh, Anna, a big one, 300 mils. A uh, bit, just one, please, just one, yes. Okay, Mr. Broke Forever is full. 
<laughs> okay, cameraman, broke forever. Camera forever. They get some like fancy B-roll like. <laughs> <laughs> he's got uh, the chipmunks. Have a look at what he's got in the background there. That's oh, Alvin, wow. Simon, and that's Theodore. Uh, what else has he got? I don't know what the other things are. Yeah, the random so baby. That's uh, chipmunks. <laughs> Colorful shop. Who's this guy? No. Fresh as it gets. Smacking the seeds straight out of the pomegranate. That's what we like to see. Fresh as it gets. Thick. It's been filtered by that. Yeah. Fair machine, no ice or anything, no additives. Just pure pomegranate juice. Exactly what you want. Oh, fantastic. Okay. <laughs> okay, thank you, my friend. Thank you. I'm gonna slam it. Thank you, amazing, wow, oh, <laughs> and that's the perfect sweet way to end today's adventure at Old Delhi. See you next time for another adventure.